Hi there, Dale from Dale Equine Nutrition here. I wanted to talk about superfibers. Superfibers are something that I write about and talk about a lot, and I thought I should clarify. So you you will see the term supervisor superfibers uh, a lot on feed bags, uh, labels. It's a marketing term. For once, it's actually quite a correct marketing term uh, to describe a horse feed. So just to Tell you straight away, a super fiber would be sugar beet pulp, lupin holes, soybean holes, lupins themselves, peas. So those those are what we categorize as super fibers in a horse feed. What they are, what makes them a super fiber, is that they are really, really high fiber, like over 90% um, structural carbohydrates little to no sugars or non-structural carbohydrates so what that means for your horse's gut is they are able to break down or ferment rather uh, over 90 percent of what's in these fibers when it goes into the hind gut it makes for a very very happy environment in the hind gut um, the horse can break down or ferment and use most of what goes in there over 90 percent also little to no starch and sugar so it doesn't upset the hindgut microbes which then can upset behavior and cause all sorts of other health issues um, like hindgut dysbiosis, laminitis, diarrhea, all those things. Um, your horse's gut loves super fibers. Um, it does not make for bad behavior, it doesn't make for a bad environment in your horse's hindgut. Really really good feed for almost any horse that you can think of in the right amounts. Um, just a note there uh, as an example for you, sugar beet pulp has almost the same amount of energy as oats but almost no starch in it. So really really great um, for keeping condition on for, for providing slow release energy um, to your horses without upsetting the hindgut, without upsetting behavior, without causing health problems that too much starch and sugar that can come from things like grain can do to your horse in the wrong amounts. So happy days to everybody. Um, really good feeds to include in your horse's diets. I hope that helps.